Hey, what's up, everybody? Me and Colby are back again. Mm -hmm. And uh, so this this time we're going to break some old packs. So I went to, uh, I ventured out to the flea market on Saturday morning and bought, um, I spent $11 uh, on the packs of cards that we're about to open. So baseball, I've got, baseball, baseball, yep, football. I've got 1990 Fleer baseball. So in here, we're going to be looking for Sammy Sosa, and Juan Gonzalez are the two best rookie cards in that pack. We've got 89 Pro Set. So we're going to look for some rookie cards and some Hall of Famers in there. We've got 88 Don Ross, which really nothing too good in here. Um, Tom Glavin, rookie, would probably be the best card that we'll be looking for in that pack. And then we got 91 Tops, which actually that card right there is possibly in. Um, and that's a Chipper Jones rookie card, So, which we already have. I've got that one back there, and I've actually got another one here already that these two are actually cards from when I was a kid that I pulled out of the pack. So maybe we can pull another Chipper Jones, uh, you know, basically 20 years later after I pulled those ones out of a pack. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> so Colby's going to start opening. We're going to start with 90 Fleer. So yeah. go ahead, Colby, start breaking those, and then uh, <clears throat> we'll go out. Yeah, give me one to start, and then open up one behind me. So no gum in this one. So here we go. It's a 90 Fleer. I think everybody, when we were kids, this was a super popular, pretty high run of these. But like I said, we're looking for a Juan Gonzalez, which I actually have one right here that I pulled when I was a kid. And then uh, what we're, the big one we're looking for is probably Sammy Sosa. It's probably actually the better card in here. So we're going to look through here. It's going to be a lot of famous names. So there's Joe Girardi, who was later on a manager. Dennis Rasmussen. This is a uh, Prospects card. Nobody good. Alejandro Pena, Kevin Gross, Jim Eisenreich, Mark Davis, Jesse Barfield, Alex Trevino, Johnny Ray, who played for the Pirates for a while. So nothing in that first one. We did get a cool Oakland Athletic sticker. The boys like those. So put on stuff. So next pack, here we go. We got a red Cincinnati Reds sticker. That's so pretty cool. And here we go. We got Gary Gaetti. He was a great player. Tommy Gregg, man, he was a hot rookie card back in the day and kind of never really panned out. Bob Kipper, Omer Vizquel, which actually, I think, it's actually an Omar Vizquel rookie card. So we'll put that, we'll put that in soft plastic. Milt Thompson, Dewey Evans, Steve Lyons. That's your boy, Colbs. Steve, why, why, why is Steve Lyons famous? He's in a, he's in a, uh, we have a, a DVD of baseball bloopers in our car that we play all the time. And what what does Steve Lyons do? <laughs> he, um, it, so bounced off his head. Then no, that was Jose Canseco. What does Steve Lyons oh. do at first base? <laughs> Remember? <laughs> Steve Lyons had dirt in his pants one time during a game, and he actually pulled his pants down at first base to get the dirt out, not knowing that he pulled the pants down. Anyway, that's a funny little tidbit. <clears throat> There's Will Clark. He was a great player. I used to love Will Clark when I was a kid. Jeff Robinson, Tim Belcher, Bob Melvin, and Rafael Ramirez. So we got one rookie so far. I'm nervous. Kel rookie cards. So that's cool. Cool Astros sticker. Yeah. <clears throat> Rich Yet. Sid Fernandez. He was a great pitcher back in the day. There's Bill Ripken, who's Kyle Ripken's brother. Kevin Apier. Gary Carter, who's a Hall of Famer. Tom Candiotti. Jose Rijo, 10th anniversary Dale Murphy card, Chris Spire, Bob Stanley. There's a Greg Maddox, another Hall of Famer. Dun, dun, dun. <clears throat> Dante Bichette, who his son is who? Boom. Bo Bichette, who's kind of the hot rookie card right now. So that's a pretty cool card to get. <clears throat> All right, next up, we got a Minnesota Twins sticker. We got Rich Gadman, Mitch Williams, the wild thing. They called him the wild thing, Colby. He was crazy when he came out of the bullpen. Dan Plezak, who's now on uh, MLB Network. Uh, Lloyd McClendon, who was the Pirates manager for a long time. And the best thing he ever did was he got in an argument with the umpires and he stole first base. Took it into the dugout. Lenny Harris, Drew Hall, Mark Langston, Jeff Montgomery, Mark Parent, and another Hall of Famer, Don Mattingly. So pretty cool. All right, last pack of 90 Fleer. We've got another four sticker. 
All right, we got Mark Williamson, Greg Vaughn, who that was a hot rookie back in the day. He kind of never really panned out either. Jerry Brown, Eric Davis, who I believe Eric Davis had a 40-40 year, if I'm not mistaken, 40 home runs and 40 stolen bases. He definitely had a 30-30 a there. He hit 37 home runs and 50 stolen bases in 87. That's pretty crazy. George Bell, <clears throat> Joe Price, Ryan Sandberg, another Hall of Famer. Jim Gantner, Willie Frazier, Shane Raleigh, and ended up with a Hall of Famer. So the last card of 90 Fleer is a Hall of Famer, Alan Trammell. So pretty cool. Nothing uh, too exciting. Like I said, we did pull a Omar Vizquel uh, rookie card. So that's pretty cool. <clears throat> All right. Let's go 88, Don Ross, next card. We'll go football. Try to do them in the best. Go ahead. I got one. Try to do them from what I think are the best packs to the or worst to best, I should say. So Don Ross here, we had the puzzle piece uh, insert here where he tried to collect all the pieces to make a puzzle out of them. So here we go. 88 Don Ross. Once again, another just high print run of these cards. There's nothing really good in here. Tommy Glavin would be what we were uh, looking for. Mike Greenwell. There we go. Andre Dawson, Diamond Kings, the Hawk, Hall of Famer. Tom Browning, Mark Gubisa, Greg Maddox, another Hall of Famer. Getting close to a Greg Maddox. That's a second year, uh, second year Greg Maddox card. So I'll we'll soft sleeve that one. Devin White, Mike Young, Kevin McReynolds, Manny Lee, Mike Scott, who was a great pitcher back in the day. Claudel Washington. Another puzzle piece. Rafael Ramirez, Keith Miller, Jose De Leon, Eric King, uh, Kent the Colby, Teak, Brett Butler, Bob James. Oh, look at that. Mike Brumley. Pretty cool. No relation. Danny Tartable. There's Billy Ripken again, uh, which is Kyle Ripken's brother. John Smiley, who had some great years with the Pirates. There's Harold Reynolds, who's on MLB Network now. And Danny Cox. Yeah. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, Daryl Strawberry. It's a cool card. Man, I used to love Daryl Strawberry back in the day. And Strawberry put up some huge numbers. People don't really realize. I mean, look at that. He hit 39 home runs and had 36 stolen bases in 87. Dave LaPointe, Eric King, Keith Hughes, Lee Gutterman, Floyd Bannister, Bill Madlock, who... He's an underrated player. Bill Madlock actually won two batting titles. Oh, geez, it was two of those. Mike Brumley, no relation. <laughs> oh, Barry Bonds. Nice, Colbs. I figured you would have got excited about that. That's pretty much a second year uh, Barry Bonds card. Which people that complain about Barry Bonds and the steroids, look at this. This is his second year, and he had 25 home runs and 32 stolen bases in his second year in the majors. About a 50 pounds lighter than the end of his career. All right, another puzzle piece. All right, we got two more packs of uh, 88 Don Ross here. So the old, the dreaded, the dreaded checklist. Rob Deere, who was pretty much a straight power hitter back in the day. Um, he hit you know, 33 home runs that year. Dave Parker, another underrated player. Dave Parker put up some huge numbers uh, in his career. Eric Davis. Gary Templeton, Pat Tabler, Larry Anderson, Ed Nunez, Obi McDowell, Paul Molitor, who's a Hall of Famer, Sid Fernandez. So that's a great, a lot of Hall of Famers in these packs. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Colby's over here trying to put the puzzle pieces together. Uh, Jimmy Key was a great pitcher. Al Pedrique, Mike Marshall, Brett Saberhagen, who won a Cy Young, Gary Pettis, Ron Darling, Ted Simmons. Matt Noakes, Ozzie Virgil, David Cohn, who I believe also won a Cy Young, Julio Franco. And it, <laughs> look at that. We finished the, the five packs of 90 Fleer. The last card was Alan Trammell. The five packs of 88 Don Ross. The last card was Alan Trammell, Hall of Famer. It's pretty ironic. Okay, we're going to open up some football now. So we've got some... Uh, this is Pro Set. I believe this is the first year they actually did it. It's 89 Pro Set, which was the first year that they came out with football. Pretty much before that, it was all tops for a long time. 
So, all right, we're still struggling on the rookie cards. We've only pulled uh, Omar Vizquel, and then we pulled a Greg Maddox and a Barry Bond second year card. So, in here, um, this is, I believe this is series one. So, we do not have a chance at the Barry Sanders rookie, but there are some other good rookies in here Chris Carter um, and a few other folks that we'll be looking for. So, there's Kurt Warner. Uh, he was a great running back back in the day, a couple thousand yard seasons. Richard Dent, who was on that great Bears defense in 85. Bill Brooks, Ricky Schuler, Andre Waters, Keena Turner, Albert Lewis, he was a great corner man, Aaron Jones, Mark May, who was on college football uh, in a pregame show for a while on ESPN. So it's a first pack of Pro Set. Let's see what we got here. Pro Set always had these Super Bowl like throwback cards. So and they had the coaches' cards too back here. So there's Buddy Ryan. Legendary coach, Albert Lewis again, Aaron Jones again, Mark May again, Sammy Winder, he was a great running back too, Marv, Marv Levy, who was the coach of those all those Bills teams that made it to the AFC Championship game and just couldn't win a Super Bowl. Dalton Hilliard, Clay Matthews, who was a great linebacker for the Brownies forever. And all right, let's go another Super Bowl card. Kicker, Reggie Roby, who was like the best punter in the league for a long time. Simon Fletcher, right full with David Little. He was a great linebacker How for the Steelers. He? he was David Little. He wasn't very little. He played inside linebacker. Shane Coleman, Ron Brown, Ray Childress, James Jones, Kevin Ross. All right, we got two packs left here on the 89 Pro Set. Roger Craig, who was a great, you know, great running back. On all those Super Bowl teams with the 49ers. Brian Shosha, Mark Murphy, Rod Woodson, Hall of Famer for the Steelers. The second year Rod Woodson card. Great Steeler. We'll sleeve him since we're big Steeler fans. James Wilder, thousand yard rusher a couple times. Kent Hall. Kevin Green, who later played for the Steelers. Great linebacker, Hall of Famer. Drew Hill, who's a great wide receiver. Man, just great names on in this pack here. Neil Smith, another great player. Tommy Kramer. Jim Lachey, who was part of the uh, Hogs on the Redskins that went to the Super Bowl. Oh, Colbs, I didn't hear you freaking out, man. Bo Jackson. The boys love Bo Jackson. They've watched the 30-30 Bo Jackson a bunch of times. So they, they, they know all the stories and have watched all the Bo Jackson uh, YouTube videos. All right, last pack pro set. So, mm -hmm. Gary Anderson, Mark Carrier, another great player. Oh, that's, uh, I think that this is, look at this, Colbs. Mm -hmm. That is the Bosa, like Joey Bosa, and what's the, what's the brother's name that both are in the NFL now? Mm -hmm. That's their dad. It's actually pretty cool to get uh, their dad. What's the other Bosa, Joey, and what's the other one? I can't remember. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Chuck Knox, legendary coach. Scott Case, Neil Anderson, he was a good running back. Albert Bentley, Tim McGee, Freeman McNeil, another good running back. I actually have his rookie card as 82 tops. Doug Smith and Randy Wright. All right, so that was it. Nothing too good out of there. We pulled the Rod Woodson and Bo Jackson uh, second-year cards or third-year cards. So that was pretty fun. All right, here we go. Last but not least is 91 tops. And like I said, in this one, we're pretty much aiming for this card right here. Um, not a whole bunch else left in here for value. So, But there is gum in here, Colbs. Want to eat it? You can. I'll eat it if you eat it. You can. Oh, man. And the gum on this one's on the front of, front of the card. This one's on the back. Here we go. All right. So we're going here with uh, 91 tops and somebody, Mike Kingery here. Has the gum, and we ain't getting that gum off of there. So Mike Kingery is going. Mike Kingery is going to the card gods. He's getting sacrificed. Nah, 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 nah. Alright, so here we go. Matt Young, Mike Stanley, the Lino de Shields, Gold Cup card. It's cool. Danny Martinez, El Presidente, Bob Melvin, O'Brien, Stump Merrill, Brett Saberhagen, second Brett Saberhagen we saw tonight. Mike Stanton. Mike Moore, Carmelo Martinez. All right, so nothing good there in the first pack. Colby's got another one. We got another one to sacrifice to the card gods here. So Jeff Houston's 
Gold cup card. He's getting sacrificed. All right, we got Joe. We got Dan Pasqual, John Moses, Mark Grant, Marvell Wynn. So there's these early '90s man. There's just kind of was a lull here with Hall of Famers and uh, Flash Gordon, Tom Gordon. He was a pretty good pitcher. It was a couple of years there. Greg Swindell, another good pitcher, a couple years in a row. Bob Tewksbury, Gerald Clark. So nothing good. We're still looking. We're still hunting for the chipper. So once again, we got another. Oh, we had to sacrifice a Hall of Famer to the card gods. No. Oh, Wade Boggs. We actually have a Wade Boggs 83 Fleer rookie card. I normally put it up here on display, but didn't bring it out for this video. All right, let's see who else we got here. I saw another Hall of Famer. It's Mickey Morandini. We've got Tom Browning, Jose De Leon, Mickey Hatcher, Mike Keith, Game Piece. Mike Harvey, Jeff Torberg, manager, John Smiley, and then Rafael Palmero, who is not in the Hall of Fame, but, I mean, he should be in the Hall of Fame. He kind of got himself in trouble, but a great, great hitter. Oh, yeah. that last one, buddy. Oh, you actually got the gum off this one, Colbs? Yeah. All right, Colby got the gum. There's a Hall of Famer, Lou Whitaker. We got Lance Johnson. Tommy Glavin. We were looking him for him in the 88. Steve Finley, Kevin Gross. Oh, yeah, I thought you did get the gum off. We did not. We got a little piece on there still. It says old Sam Horn's getting sacrificed. Game piece. There's a Cecil Fielder, all-star card. Schooler. Barry Bonds, all-star card. I, I soft sleeve all my Barry Bonds cards just because I'm a Pirates fan. So, anyway. All right. Last pack of the video. Let's see if we can pull a Chipper Jones in the last pack of the video. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Did you get the gum off this one? Nope. Ah, mm. oh, Don Slot, former pirate catcher Don Slot is getting sacrificed oh, the to the card gods. <laughs> no, All right, let's see if we pull a Chipper Jones in this last pack. So, let's see what we got. Dave Steeb, Obi McDowell. Joe Morgan, Andy Van Slyke, cool card, I like that card, Buckos, Pete Smith, oh, Randy Johnson, there's a Hall of Famer, Randy Johnson, Mark Witten, the wild thing again, Mitch Williams, and the last card is Jack McDowell. All right, so that was a fun little video, just opening up some 90s packs from our childhood. I kind of knew, you know, there really wasn't a whole lot of value that we were looking for, but it was worth $10 at the flea market. So probably the best card we got was, you know, obviously the Omar Vizquel. Andy Bo Jackson is a good card in my mind. Just legendary, him with the Raiders, just running away from people. And then I like the second year Barry Bonds card I thought was pretty cool too. So that's it, folks. We'll be back. we got a lot of packs of cards stacked up. I've got some some older packs of baseball lined up and then we have our monthly box that we'll be getting here uh, next week so that's it colby likes the bow jackson all right we'll see you guys later say bye colbs bye